Stop, thief! Gotcha. Give me back my wallet. Don't be afraid. You have a family now. We will protect you. We have a new case, my friend. Dear August Dupin, my town desperately needs your help. Our children are disappearing, including my own son. I believe they are in great danger. And, and that mysterious Crows League is involved. For reasons you can surely understand. Well, it's nine o'clock, and we're near the old Smuggler Tavern. This is the time and place our client wanted to meet. See that man with the covered face? Let's see if that's him. Who are you? Ah, detectives. Good. Your client asked me to check your qualifications with a bit of a test. Go inside the tavern. If you can get back out alive, your client will be waiting for you here. Another couple of souls come to take my test. Your employer must be running out of options. All right, I'll give you a test. If you pass, you'll get something in return. Years ago, my wife Mary and I ran this tavern. Business was booming. 
We were the envy of the town. We had a daughter named Lenore. She was smart, witty, restless, and the love of our lives. But one day, evil came into our home. A group of smugglers wanted to take what we had. We were peaceful people. We couldn't fight them. Before she died, Mary managed to hide our little girl. While the murderers searched our... The smuggler ripped the wedding band from Mary's finger to break our bond in the afterlife. That's how Mary and I became... Mary's spirit was pulled into the crow mirror. Her soul is locked inside, so I can't give... The crow mirror is hidden by darkness, which can only be cleared away with magic heat. Clear the darkness to see Mary. Give the ring to her, and I'll release you from the tavern. Clear the darkness from the crow mirror, and give Mary the ring.
Thank you, mortal. Now we can leave this world and find peace. And you can leave this cursed place and meet your employer. This is a map of the underground smuggler's maze. It leads into the city. And one more thing. Please do not hurt our girl Lenore, no matter what. <sighs> Strangest feeling. Like I've overslept. Ah, but you've completed our task. Let's go talk to our client. Don't move! Who are you? What did you do to him? Please, calm down. I'm Thomas Gullinger, the mayor of Goldstown. You must be the detectives I hired. I doubt anyone else would have the courage to enter the tavern and come out alive. Now we can get down to business. I apologize for testing you, but I had to know you were the best. I'll answer any questions you have. Have any more questions? Dear Father, you must resign as mayor immediately and relinquish power to more capable people. If you do not do this by 10 p.m. on December 10th, there will be consequences. Those who will replace you are very powerful and dangerous. Do not speak to the police or call for help of any kind. If you value my life and your own, you must do as I say. And remember, they are always watching. Alan. people he talks about. It must be the Secret Crows League. They made him write this, I'm certain of it. The murderers marked with crow feathers must be their doing as well. This is a tricky one. We need to get into the city without being seen and save Alan, who is most likely in the theater. I hope you're feeling brave, my friend. Let's go search for the secret passage to the city in the cemetery. Get into town through the underground passage and save my son. <laughs> 